to all you Torians! Hello and welcome for um, looking at this monthly video, uh, monthly horoscope in general for the sign of Taurus. Now, this is for all the fixed signs and you are a fixed sign, a very interesting and important month, the month of November. Because I'm going to focus on this solar eclipse that is going to happen. So of course there are little things going on and little aspects going on during this month but for you Taurians I really have to focus on this solar eclipse because it's happening on a very important house of yours and you're a fixed sign and I'll, I'll uh, explain in a minute why it is so important for you that solar eclipse. Um, I have made a separate video about the solar eclipse and um, I think if you are interested in astrology please do have a look because a lot of people don't really know the meaning of the solar eclipses and it is so crucial to know that uh, even this, this solar eclipse is happening in Scorpio but even that is just uh, becoming more relevant at the end. First of all you have to look at what is this eclipse all about. It's not random, it belongs to a certain family which is called the Saras family and more in detail about that in that other video. Um, but it, it surely, it simply means that um, every eclipse has a color and every eclipse has a, a flavor and you've got eclipses that are very difficult and challenging. That is all about separation and then, you know, we have to make a video and say things are going on with separation. But we are lucky, this one, this solar eclipse is a very positive one. And there are two keywords that are involved here with the solar eclipse of the 13th of November. And that is enjoyment, which is nice, and commitment and connecting which is also nice if you put the two together, which means through your connections, through your commitment, um, not necessarily towards a person, but in your case, it is towards a person, um, and then enjoyment. So that is uh, applicable for all the signs. But now let's get a bit deeper to your sign, more into detail to what does it mean for Taurians? Okay, now, so we know that it's a good eclipse. It's um, uh, it's a building up through. That's why I talk about it for the whole month. It's a building up towards the 13th of November that the sun will conjunct uh, to with the moon, and that is an eclipse. That's a new moon, which is all about endings and new beginnings. And for you Taurians, this happens in Scorpio, which is your seventh house which is a crucial house. You know, the first house, the fourth house, the seven and the tenth are key houses. That doesn't mean to say that other houses are not important. It simply say that they are key areas of life and they have a knock-on effect on other, uh, on other houses. So what does it mean in general for Taurians? It means that there is a highlight on your seventh house, the house of that significant other person in your life. If you are single, this is really the time to go out and connect with other people. You're going to enjoy it because that's the flavor of the eclipse. If you are in a relationship um, it, or are just beginning with, this re with a new relationship, it means that there is a whole new beginning that is going to um, maybe uh, get you both on a higher, higher level, higher commitment level, and it will bring you joy. If it's a bad relationship and you really don't feel good about your relationship, it's a good time to end it and to make place for new, a new relationship to go in, to get in. So all this is, is very positive. You could say, I'm having a bad relationship, can't do anything about it. Well, now is the time to take your steps and to commit yourself to um, what you have set to, uh, to, to yourself. So for Taurians, a very important, um, a very important period and, um, and, and a very positive one, I think, when you commit yourself with what you really think is good for you and um, that will lead you 
to um, you know the next upcoming months to enjoyment and that is a very good uh, and a very nice thing that is going on so it's all about commitment and enjoyment so Taurians uh, really have a good time during the month of November it's a time of decision making it's a time of uh, committing of responsibility uh, in relationships for you uh, whether you have one or not if you're not having a relationship and you want one it really is a time to open your heart and just delete the past and I know for Taurus that is not easy to do to um, to let go of things but you can do it and uh, wish you all the best wish you good luck for the month of November and see you next month bye bye